You just hit two Kobe grenades in the side of the tank. It's pretty difficult. Impressive. Otherwise, it's four hits. Well, I don't know if you know this. I'm kind of a fucking god gamer. Uh, Keith, thank you for the tier two 37 months. Thank you very much. Kind of, kind of, I'm kind of a big deal. Member of TSM. You may not know, you may not know that. Son of a bitch. Uh, Pierre the Cactus. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Kevlar Del Mar. Thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Greatly appreciate that. Thanks so much. For sure, the TSM. What do you see? You gotta get close to the fucking tank. What else do you expect? You gotta get close. I don't know. Can you shoot it with a machine gun from far away? That doesn't seem right. Be careful. You absolutely must not use weapons in that area. I've already programmed Son the nano machine, so he won't be able to, Colonel. What? What are you talking about? Have you forgotten? That's where they keep the nuclear warheads. Uh, light them? kills. Yeah, Thank you for the 17 months. Thank you very much. Are they all warheads? Yes, they're all dismantled warheads. They just leave them here? It's like President Baker said. Totally careless. They're working on a limited budget. They try to put on a pretty face for the media, but this is the grim reality of it. Nastasha knows lots more about it than I do. Nastasha. The frequency is 141.52. Uh, All of the warheads Dante Magnum, thank you for the five gift subs. But if the warheads are broken, they might leak plutonium, and that would be a serious problem. Thank you very Snake, much. Never use your weapon on that floor. No use. Got you. Eh? I don't remember how far I made it. That was uh that was apparently like two years ago. I don't remember how far I got. It was quite some time ago. Me no use weapon. She's optional but very cool. Can you, uh, oh, you can. my weapons but they can they're taking the oxygen out again <laughs> it's FTL all over again I didn't suffocate to death. Uh, thank you, Dante Magnum, for five gift subs. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much. These cameras they have kind of suck. <laughs> they kind of got some shitty cameras, don't they? Loot goblin. You're so okay with tank controls? Son of a bitch. I'd say the Metal Gear Solid control scheme probably makes more hey, sense. Thanks for the gift sub, Yug. I think it probably makes more sense than like Resident Evil overall. Probably. But that's, uh, that's a pretty low bar. Uh, there's something over there. I'm going to go grab that. Uh, thank you very much, Nightwing. Thank you. There's a couple things over here. Uh, grenades. Uh, Nightwing, thanks so much for the gift sub. 
Really appreciate that. Thank you so much, dude. No, and no radar and enemies and cameras have human eyesight. Sounds delightful. I love they, they make you wait for the elevators. Uh, all right, I guess we're going here first. Uh, thank you, Nightwing. Rano the Painter, thank you for the 12 months. Thank you very much. One year with my favorite streamer on Twitch. Aw, thank you. That's so sweet. Best room. Okay. I see you like Konomi games. Double tap, elevator skips waiting. That's the ladies' restroom. Oh, so we, we can now use weapons again. It's just in that particular room. I guess it automatically has the uh, suppressor on, huh? Uh, graphics all the way from the year 2000. Hey, this game has a really good uh, checkpoint system. It's got a good checkpoint system. Not too shabby. say it has checkpoints uh, I mean I don't know I feel like I've played so many classic games where it's like yup you gotta like go I'll give you an example God of War on PlayStation 2 which is after this game oh you died uh go back like 15 minutes of fucking hacking through enemies enjoy Nikita missile Nikita Nikita launcher yeah oh it's like a stinger missile huh wow okay got you ah uh, that's a pretty serious find there Shabby. La Femme Nikita. Uh, chat begged me to play on normal. I mean, I, I don't know what the game is like on the harder difficulties, but I think it isn't Metal Gear Solid kind of designed to be played with the map. So like taking away the map seems kind of, seems kind of rough on this style of game. Uh, Hotline Miami is a good top down. Uh, do we not have any more booze, do we? Is that spotting? Sure, babe. Sounds good. You're jealous? <laughs> Katie, Katie wants my beer. You can, honey, you can have that beer if you want to. <laughs> you just got to be more aware. You probably got to take your time more and that sort of thing. I mean, I'm sure it's, I'm sure it's doable. Uh, you need a hundred percent first person perspective. If you want to play without the radar. Uh, okay. So it looks like we, we got the missile, but I guess there's nothing left to do here. Let's go down another. Maybe just chat wanted me to have a good time. And after the surge too, maybe that was it. <laughs> maybe that was part of it. Like, listen, we. We're sick of you being miserable. Intervention. 
I did finish the search too. It was awful. Snake, watch out. That place is filled with gas. Thank you. Also, the floor is electrified. First, destroy the high voltage switch. It's the switchboard on the northwest wall. But how? I can't reach it. Use a remote controlled missile. Who are you? Just call me Deep Throat. Deep Throat? The informant from the Watergate scandal? Never mind about that. You're not using burst transmission. Are you nearby? Who are you anyway? One of your fans. Uh, I am running out of air. Is that like a timer? Okay. Uh, it said Northwest. Okay, okay, so you can fire it. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. You know what? Kind of feel like saving. <laughs> Let's go Wait, save after that shit. How can someone outside of this operation cut into my codec? You're talking about that guy calling himself Deep Throat. We were monitoring from here. What about it? Well, if somebody knows your frequency, they can call you. But the question is, how did he learn it? It's top secret information. Can you tell me where he called from? I'm sorry. The signal is too weak to locate its source. But I'm sure he's near you, somewhere on the base. Okay. You make me want to get some alcohol right now. Be careful, Snake. I brute force like 200 frequencies. Bullshit. Bullshit. Um. Dude, he, he cheated the whole thing. Udichi, thank you for the 500 bits. Thank you very much. It looks like they were cut by some type of blade. Was this Kojima's first game? Uh... I don't think so. It's a ghost. I don't think so. What was Kojima's first game though? I don't think it was this one. He made Metal Gear. I thought he came on only at Metal Gear Solid, I thought.
No, oh, okay. A penguin game? Did that one also have three hour cutscenes? Ah, Metal Gear NES, okay. It's a lot of piss. What? What Man, is he still about? pissing? Oh, what next? Snake. You're that ninja. I've been waiting for you, Snake. Who are you? Neither enemy nor friend. The way their heads move I'm reminds me of classic world. red versus Such blue. <laughs> Ever wonder why I we're here? All obstacles. Now you and I will battle to the death. What do you want? I've waited a long time for this day. Now I want to enjoy the moment. What's with these guys? It's like one of my Japanese animes. <laughs> I've come from another world. This is just back. like one of my animes. What is it? Revenge? It is nothing so trivial as revenge. A fight to the death with you. Only in that can my soul find respect. I will kill you, or you will kill me. It makes no difference. No! Ah, fine. He can watch from inside there. I need that man. Keep your hands off him. Now, make me feel it. Make me feel alive again. Um. Get this people here. Snake, you that ground pound shit ah ow jeez What? <laughs> uh oh. I'm here, Snake. Where are you? The game uh gets a bit choppy. Bit of a performance chop. I wonder if that performance chop was al was also on the original PlayStation One as well. I've been waiting for this game. 
Yeah, we're playing on good old games. He teleported behind me. Ow! Do you remember Snake? The feel of battle, the clashing of bone and sinew. That's good, Snake. Zanzibar. Dude, Otacon is just shitting and pissing. <laughs> oh, oh, my Lanta. This is just like my animes. Gray Fox. Colonel, that ninja is Gray Fox. You're the Gray no Fox. Doubt about it. Ridiculous. You of all people should know he died in Zanzibar. No. He should have died, but he didn't. What? It happened before I What's the story? Fox uh, when staff. this cutscene ends in, in an hour from now, I'll tell you about it, I think. Experiments. I never heard that. It happened right after you retired. My predecessor, Dr. Clark, was in charge. Dr. Clark? Yes. He started the gene therapy project. And where is he now? He was killed in an explosion in his lab two years ago. <laughs> so what about this soldier? Apparently, for their test subject, they decided to use the body of a soldier who was recovered after the fall of Zanzibar. And that was Grey Fox. But he was Two already dead. Two hours later. Yes. But they revived him. They fitted him with a prototype exoskeleton and kept him drugged for four years while they experimented on him like a plaything. Today's genome soldiers were born from those experiments. That's the sickest thing I ever heard. <laughs> they used him to test all sorts of gene therapy techniques. Naomi, why didn't you tell us about this sooner? Because it's confidential information. Is that the only reason? Naomi, what happened to Grey Fox after that? 
The record says he died in the explosion. I see. But even if that ninja is Grey Fox, the question is, why? From what I could tell, he didn't know who he was. Are you saying that he's just a mindless robot? I'm not sure, but he seems intent on fighting me to the death. We'll meet again. I know it. So you'll fight again? Until you kill him? Huh. I'd rather not. But maybe that's what he wants. How long are you gonna stay in there? Huh? Are you one of them? No, I'm not. Is there no, a bathroom nearby? <laughs> Alone? Are you an otaku too? Come on, get out. We can't stay here forever. God, it smells in here. What did you do? Your uniform is different than theirs. You're the Metal Gear Chief Engineer, Hal Emmerich, right? You know me? I heard about you from Merrill. Oh, so you're here to rescue me. Sorry, but no. There's something that I've got to do first. Oh, well, at least you're not one of them. Huh, are you hurt? Oh, I'm okay. I just twisted my ankle a little bit trying to get away. Well, if that's all, it's nothing to worry about. I want to ask you something. I need Oh, that's just the, that's just gear. the shit in my pants. Um, Metal Gear? <laughs> yeah. What's Metal Gear really designed for? It's a mobile TMD. It's designed to shoot down nuclear missiles, only for defensive purposes, of course. Fire. <laughs> I already know that Metal Gear is nothing but a nuclear-equipped walking deathmobile. Nuclear? W what are you talking about? The terrorists are planning to use Metal Gear to launch a nuclear missile. Are you telling me you didn't know? They're gonna put a dismantled warhead into Metal Gear's TMD missile module? Wrong. From the beginning, the purpose of this exercise was to test Metal Gear's nuclear launch capability using a dummy nuclear warhead. The terrorists are just continuing the work you started. No, you're wrong. I heard it directly from your boss, Baker. No. A nuclear missile on Rex? So you really didn't know? No. All the armament was built by a separate department, and the president personally supervised the final assembly of the main unit. President Baker? Yeah. I was never told exactly what they armed Rex with. I, I only know it's equipped with a Vulcan cannon, a laser, and a railgun. Oh, a laser. Oh, a boy. A railgun, you said. <laughs> yeah. It uses magnets to fire Is that all? at extremely high velocities. The technology was originally developed for the SDI system and, and later scrapped. We were successful in miniaturizing it in a joint venture between Arms Tech and Rivermore National Labs. The railgun is on Rex's right arm. Metal Gear's main function is to launch nuclear missiles. You sure you're not forgetting something? It's true that Metal Gear has a missile module on his back that can carry up to eight missiles, but are you saying it was originally meant to carry nuclear missiles? Yeah, but that's not all I think. If Metal Gear fired only standard nuclear missiles, then they should already have all the practical data they need. No. Could it be? Metal Gear's co-developer, Rivermore National Labs, was working on a new type of nuclear weapon. They were using Nova and NIF laser nuclear fusion testing equipment and supercomputers. So they developed a new type of nuclear weapon in a VR testing lab, huh? Yes, but you can't use virtual data on a battlefield. They would need actual launch data. These are some of the supercomputers. If you link these, you can test everything in a virtual environment. But it's all just theoretical. So this exercise was designed to test the real thing. What did our president do? If the terrorists launched that thing... <sighs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. I'm such a fool. It's all my fault. <laughs> Boy. 
My grandfather was part of the Manhattan Project. He suffered with the guilt for the rest of his life. And my father, he was born on August 6th, 1945. The day of the Hiroshima bomb. God's got a sense of humor, all right. Three generations of Emmerich men. We must have the curse of nuclear weapons written into our DNA. Uh, we, we haven't watched Peaky Blinders in a while. We kind of gave up. I used up. to think that I could use science to help mankind. But the one that wound up getting used was me. Using science to help mankind? It's just in the movies. <laughs> That's enough crying. Pull yourself together. Where is Metal Gear? Where on this base are they keeping it? God! Rex is in the underground maintenance base. Where's that? <laughs> North of the communications tower, but it's a long way there. The emergency override system for the detonation code is there too. Yeah, in the maintenance base control room. You'd better hurry. If they were planning a launch from the start, then their ballistic program is probably finished. And since they haven't called for me in a few hours, they must not need me. In other words, they must be ready to launch. Meryl's got the detonation code override keys. We'll link up with her. If we can't override the launch, we'll have to destroy Rex. Drinking for this one's a good idea. I'll show you the way. On that leg of yours, you'll just slow me down. You'll need me if you're going to destroy Rex. I don't need you. I just need your brain. I created Rex. It's my right, my duty to destroy him. If you get a chance, try to escape. When the coast is clear, I'll contact you by codec. How am I supposed to escape from an island? Uh, okay. So what then? I want you to hide somewhere and keep me informed. You know this place well, don't you? Of course I do. And don't worry, I've got this. It's the same stealth technology as the ninja. Foxhound was gonna use them, but with this I'll be fine. Bad leg and all. Good. But I want Meryl to watch after you, too. Oh, my goodness. Meryl, wow. The engineer's okay. <laughs> That's a relief. I want you to look after him. Where are you now? Very close. There she is. Over there. <gasps> oh, no. Damn, they've spotted me. <laughs> this is a Chipotle-sized dump of information. Something's wrong. Did you hear something? Wasn't that some kind of music? What did she look like? Give this people air. She, she was wearing the same green uniform as the terrorists. Juan Dresden, thank you for the 30 months. She thank you very much. Way of walking. She kind of wiggles her behind. You were really looking. Well, she's got a very cute behind. Way of walking, huh? If she's disguised as the enemy, you'll have to contact her when she's alone, huh? There's only one place where we can be sure she's by herself. Where's that? Don't be so dense. Here, use this security card. It's security level four. You're not in pain, are you? Huh? You feel okay? Nothing bothering you? What's wrong? Getting all friendly all of a sudden. No, nothing. I'm glad you're okay. You're strange. I'm a little nervous. Everyone else I've saved suddenly dies. You're bad luck. Forget it, Doctor. Call me Otakon. Otakon? It stands for Otaku Convention. <laughs> and Otaku's a guy like me who likes Japanimation. Japan was the first country to successfully make bipedal robots. They're still the best in the field of robotics. Two hours Japanese later. Japanese played some part in that? They did. I didn't get into science to make nuclear weapons, you know. That's what all scientists say. I became a scientist because I wanted to make robots like the ones in the Japanese animes. Really, it's true. It just sounds like a childish excuse to me. You're right. We have to take responsibility. Science has always thrived on war. Greatest weapons of mass destruction were created by scientists who wanted to be famous. But that's all over now. I won't take part in murder anymore. Whatever. All I want from you is information. Sure. 
I know everything about this whole base. Ask me anything about Rex or about this place. Also, with this stealth camouflage, I can sneak in and out of the armory and mess hall. If you need ammo or rations, just tell me and I'll bring them to you. I'm on frequency 141.12. See you later. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh was that the deep breath? <laughs> what was that? God, how that was so long. Oh my god. Uh, Juan Dresden, thank you for the 30 months. Sly Axis, thank you for the tier 2 49 months. Thank you very much. I greatly appreciate that. Story recap now. Okay. All right, chat. I'll give you the story recap. Of short. Yeah, I know it gets Science longer. Thrives on war. That card game is more strategic than chess. Uh, Werewolf, thanks for $3. Uh, Juan Dresden, Lieutenant Dan, Sly Axis, Barefoot Ben, thank you for the resubs. Thank you very much. Okay. Story so far. Terrorists on this island are threatening to bomb the White House with a nuclear bomb. They apparently have a nuclear bomb. They had two hostages, I guess, and I was sent in, or Snake was sent in, to save those hostages. Now, both hostages have mysteriously died. Also, the terrorists appear to be former members of, like, Foxhound, which I guess is the group that, I, that I'm a part of, I guess. They were former members of it. Uh, and they are requesting the remains of the big boss. Now, how are they going to fire the nuclear weapon? They apparently have a Metal Gear Rex, which was made by this guy. Uh, and he was unwitting, didn't know, whatever. Uh, and that's what they're going to use to fire the nuclear weapon, essentially. We also met Meryl, and uh, mostly what we've talked about is her ass so far. That's mostly what we've talked about. Uh, there's the revolver guy who got Give his hand cut off. Uh, there's a ninja who apparently is some kind of cyborg from our past. Yeah, we've literally mostly talked about her ass, essentially. That's all All we know is all we really know about her. Oh, she's the colonel's, like, uh, uh, nephew or something. I don't know, something like that. So, how was that? Pretty okay? Not bad? Niece? Whatever, niece, yeah. 8.5 out of 10. That, that's what we know so far. Now, I know that there's some things later on that are going to probably get revealed. You suck! Yeah, female yeah, nephew. Uh, also, uh, uh, Otaku Convention, a.k.a. Otakon, he pissed himself. There should be, like, his puddle of piss over here somewhere. <laughs> Where's Otacon's pile of piss? Was there a PlayStation 1 on the desk again? Where is that? I don't know. Uh, oh, there it is. Is that the PlayStation 1? Can you, can you play? Can you play? Oh, you can't play it. The middle desk? Yeah, yeah. Oh, is that a... I, you know, I've never seen a Japanese PS1, actually. I don't know what a Japanese PS1 looks like. Give this uh, people here. Let's save. Einstein said that only a life lived for others is worth living. Uh, Kachimala, thanks for 26 MIT months. Oh, dear God, friend. thank you for 20 months. Thank you very much. Just a theoretical stuff. I wanted to make things for people. The Soliton radar system or the Codex system. I just wanted to make something that would be useful for people. I think that it was the same for Dr. Emmerich, too. But he was used like a tool. Used to make a horrible killing machine. Maybe it would be better if engineers like us just stopped making things. I don't know. <laughs> Snake's like, I just want to save. No, I was going to do a new... Damn it. Uh, I got to call her back. What is it, Snake? Can I not, uh, I can't save there, I guess. Okay. Wei Ling, how did you get into this line of work? The truth is, I always wanted to become a fighter pilot. I fell in love with jets watching them in the movies. You'd be surprised how many people say the same thing. Come on, but don't bullshit me. People. That's when I heard that the yeah, you can skip everything in this game if you want to. Battle damage assessment. 
those are the guys whose job it is to confirm. When I was a boy, I. Yeah, so I started to do research into aerial photography and air intelligence. I made it my major. But there are no pilots who only do BDAs. That's right. But by the time I learned that, I was already an expert in my field. Metal Gear Solid speedrun when? Uh, okay, so we now have a level four card. I guess like as you go, your maximum health increases and also your maximum ammo count at just like as you play the game. Ow, 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 ow. What am a bitch? Uh, oxygen. Air. Get these people air. Ow. Ah. Ah, God. Ugh. Oh. I wonder if I missed something else. Uh, Radesk, thank you for the 15 months. Definitely alive. Thank you for the 34 months. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Okay. I feel like we haven't hit the... Okay, now it's time for the story to completely shit its pants. I feel like we haven't hit that yet. As somebody who has played Kojima games, I am waiting for the story to completely shit its pants. Ah, uh, Foolish One Games. Thank you for the 52 months. Thank you very much. Yeah, it hasn't happened yet, but I'm, I'm waiting for it. But that is one steamy piss this man has taken. It's the steamiest piss I've ever seen. Very close. <laughs> I remember thinking like, uh... I, I don't I don't know that I know that people know the history of this of this franchise really well. I remember I remember playing after playing Metal Gear Solid 2, I played Metal Gear Solid 3. And I remember thinking that the story in Metal Gear Solid 3 for the most part always kind of made sense to me. Like it didn't it didn't lose me. Oh, is there another way? What does cardboard box B? So this is A. What is what is cardboard box B? Huh. What's the difference? Uh, oh, to nuclear war, no, war, okay, to nuclear warhead storage building is written on it. What about cardboard box A? To heliport. Oh, interesting. Maybe we have to like mail ourselves somewhere. Lots of stuff. I like stuff. Metal Gear Solid 3 is the best bomb movie. I thought, I remember as playing Metal Gear Solid 3, uh, I thought that the story never really like stopped making sense. Like I felt like I understood the pretty much the whole thing. Oh, uh, let's deal with that cute emote over your head. It's a tier two emote of my cat snake. Will she still shoot me? You suck, you duckass. Snake. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? Snake. Snake. It's 
So like I gotta wait, I gotta look at all the guards' asses. Is that it? All right, hang on, hang on. Come on, don't bullshit me. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. So that was her. And she was just like, uh, okay, bye. Interesting. I honestly just want to look at her butt. Oh, her butt doesn't look that great. <laughs> it's confirmed I can't. She's got dumps like a truck. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah, you can hear that. I guess that's the sound of big booty. You can hear the wiggle, yeah. <laughs> uh, I was like, guess worst. I guess that was it here. Oh, did, I got cardboard box B, right? I do wonder if I have to mail myself somewhere. <laughs> okay. I am butt shaming a video game again. I was gonna say, I've, I've, my wife has walked by me many times. I've never heard her, and she's, uh... <laughs> Shit. I'm getting fucking gassed. God damn it. Invader Evan, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Appreciate the resub. Thank you, dude. I'm trolling for sure. Come on, don't bullshit me. God, really? Can I survive the, uh, Whoa! <laughs> I survived! I lived, bitch. Uh, I don't have a gas mask. Just the box. Um, 
Nuclear warhead storage building. So I'm in the nuclear storage warhead building. Is this box A? This is a teleport. Uh, where did the game want me to go now? Am I going back? I can't go back through here. Um, shit. Hmm. Let's see. Okay. No, I didn't hate the cutscene. I feel like Kojima's cutscenes do a pretty good job of keeping you like engaged. Well, it looks like you've rescued Emmerich for the time being. Yeah, with that stealth camouflage, he should be able to hide safely. Sometimes, yeah. Ray Fox, I can't believe it. But the real problem is your niece. The way the codec got cut off like that has me worried. Something must have happened to her. You're worried about Mara? Not exactly. It's just that she's holding the detonation code over our keys. They're our last chance of stopping that nuclear launch. They are a bit the long code. sometimes, yes. Your mission is more important than the life of your companions? This is war. Survival is the name of the game. Sometimes you have to be cold to survive. Yes, but... Snake, either way, I want you to find Meryl as soon as possible. I understand. Okay, so we, we found Meryl, actually. So I, I, I was where I needed to go? All right, what happens if I kill the other guards? What happens if I kill the guards? The not Meryl guards. guy's taking a leak again. The U.S. military has tested the effectiveness of the cardboard box. I think they've tested the effectiveness of a lot of things, right? You gotta follow her to the bathroom. <laughs> Your Meryl? There's no way you could pass for a man for long. What do you mean? Hey, men aren't allowed in here. I had no idea you were so feminine. This is no time to try and hit on me, Snake. <laughs> Besides, it's a waste of time. When I joined up, they gave me psychotherapy to destroy my interest in men. Same smart mouth. You're Meryl. Son of a bitch. Not yet. After all, I was disguised as a genome soldier. So why'd you change? You'd be a lot better off. What did they do? Like did they did they have her read Star Wars forum myself. posts or something for years? The truth is, the uniform smelled like blood. What's that mark? Reddit. Oh, this? It's a paint tattoo. It's not real. I was a fan of Foxhound way back, and guys like you and my uncle were in it. None of that gene therapy like there is today. You guys were real heroes. There are no heroes in war. All the heroes I know are either dead or in prison. One or the other. But Snake, you're a hero, aren't you? I'm just a man who's good at what he does. Killing. There's no winning or losing for a mercenary. The only winners in war are the people. That's right, and you fight for the people. I've never fought for anyone. You know how I bet you do a good sn uh, no snake voice life, would be uh, no the guy who did the voice for Spike Spiegel. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battle. They have kind of a similar Every voice. I feel truly alive. Seeing other people die makes you feel alive, huh? You love war and don't want it to stop. It he could do a good snake voice. Soldiers throughout history. Very, it's pretty close. Why didn't you contact me? My codec was broken. Is that all? Shouldn't you just be happy we met up like this? How did you recognize me in disguise? I never forget a lady. So there's something you like about me, huh? Yeah, you've got a great butt. Oh, I see. First it's my eyes, now it's my butt. What's next? On the battlefield, you never think about what's next. So Snake, how are the negotiations going? No progress. So it's all up to you, huh? Somebody's got to stop them from launching a nuclear missile. There are two ways. Either we destroy Metal Gear or... 
We override the detonation code. You got the card keys from Baker? Card keys? Of you course. <laughs> Where are the others? Of there course. Be three keys. This is all I've got. Where could the other two be? I have no idea, but they must be somewhere. If we can't find them, we'll have no choice but to destroy Metal Gear. Metal Gear is in an underground maintenance base to the north. Take me too. I know this place better than you do. You'll just slow me down. You don't have enough battle experience. I won't slow you down. I promise. And what if you do? Then you can shoot me. I don't like to waste bullets. Got it. I'll be careful. You know, I don't use makeup the way other people <laughs> do. I hardly ever look at myself in the mirror. I've always despised that kind of woman. I always dreamed of becoming a soldier. But I was wrong. It wasn't really my dream. My father. He was killed in action when I was younger. You wanted to follow in your father's footsteps? Not really. I thought that if I became a soldier, I could understand him better. So are you a soldier yet? I thought I was until today, but now I understand. The truth is, I was just afraid of looking at myself, afraid of having to make my own decisions in life. But I'm not gonna lie to myself anymore. It's time I took a long, hard look at myself. I want to know who I am, what I'm capable of. I want to know why I've lived the way I've lived until now. I want to know. Take a good look. You won't get another chance for a while. You should wash your face, too, while you're at it. Yeah. This isn't a training exercise. Our lives are riding on this. There are no heroes or heroines. If you lose, you're worm food. Yeah. Is that FAMAS functional? Unfortunately, it's out of ammo. Where did you get that Desert Eagle? I found it in the armory. It's a 50 caliber Action Express. There was a SOCOM pistol too, but I chose this. Huh, so I got a leftover, huh? Isn't that gun a little big for a girl? Don't worry, I can handle it. Come on, use my 45. Listen, I've used a gun like this since I was eight years old. I'm more comfortable with it than I am with a bra. <laughs> If we're gonna go to the north, we'll have to go through the commander's room on this floor. The overland route is blocked by glaciers. The door to the commander's room is security level 5. This card will open. Two hours it was inside later. the pocket of the uniform I was wearing. Looks like he must have been guarding someplace important. God, she's got a lot of stuff in her boobs. <laughs> okay, let's go. I know this place better than you. I'll be point man. Follow me. That's strange. There's no guard. What happened to the music? I'll keep a lookout. Make sure you're ready, okay? Two hours later. I feel like something stupid's about to happen. Okay, so now that we have level five, we can go this way, right? Okay. Don't come here, Snake! Are you okay? Uh, uh, what happened? I'm fine. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Mr. Foxhound, the commander is waiting. Nothing suspicious. Snake, how do you like 
like me? What the? Do you like me? Hold me, a snake. What's wrong? Oh, oh, hurry, hurry. Make love to me. Oh, snake, I want you. Who's that? Oh, you don't like girls? Snake, Meryl's not herself. Don't use your weapon. It's Psycho Mantis. He's controlling Meryl. That tune is his mind control music. Don't use your weapon. Try to knock her out. That tune is her mind control music. What about... Can I reach this guy? Oh, we knocked her out. Useless woman. Hey! Camouflage, huh? I hope that's not your only trick. You... You doubt my power. Now, I will show you why I am the most powerful practitioner of psychokinesis and telepathy in the world. No, there's no need for words, Snake. I'm Psychomantis! That's right. This is no trick. It's true power. Huh. It's useless, I told you. I can read your every thought. Ow! Oh, God! Did I hit him? Uh, uh, I'm not hitting him at all. Can he hit himself? No. Uh, stun grenade? Well, they're giving me bullets, so it kind of seems like I can. Uh, grenades? I hit him with something, apparently. I don't know what I hit him with. Uh, that appears to... Throwing grenades appears to not be it. That appears to not be it. Aw, oh, come on. Yeah. You son of a bitch. Uh, Mr. Friendship, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Colonel, you are need Uh Okay, hang on. Snake. Go son of a Meryl. bitch. Yes, why? Snake. Oh, it's because I'm Come hitting on. that. That's Don't why. Don't bullshit me. Yeah. Give this people air. Ah, uh, Beardsu, thank you for the six months. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thank you, Beardsu. Uh, Johnson, don't worry about spoiler chat. You don't have to. You don't have to spam emotes. I I didn't see anything, so don't worry about it, chat. Relax. No, please do not fill the chat with emotes. Thank you. <laughs> there's there's no need. I didn't see anything. Don't worry about it. Okay. Got it. I'm fine. Uh, Johnsonator, Beardsu, thanks for the resub. Pcaf, thanks for the resub. Snake, Meryl's not. Yep. Okay. Oh, I mean, emotes are fine, but we don't have to spam. I didn't see anything, so don't worry about it.
you're a dick. What do you want? Uh, wait. How did that... How did that work? Man, it's, it's really, I don't understand it yet. I really don't. It's like he's not where he is. I don't, I don't understand it yet. I don't know what the game wants from me. Uh. I mean, is there something I'm supposed to be seeing? How? I don't, I don't see it. They're gonna be like right up to him. What I gotta do? It kind of sounds like there's like an audio thing. Like I'm, maybe I'm supposed to be following his audio or something. Uh, I don't get. I really don't get this. I don't understand it. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. Uh, I think I'm dead. Yeah. It's just so random when I actually do shoot him. I don't, I really, really, I'm so, I'm so baffled by this. I don't understand. I really, really don't. I don't understand this. Like it sounds like the audio is moving from left to right. So like I'm wondering if that is trying to tell me something, but I honest I honestly don't know. Uh, I'm not seeing it here. I'm not looking for help. Please do not help. Chat's so smart. I mean, I can't believe Chat knows what to do in this game that's 30 years old. <laughs> I'm sure you do. I've never seen this game. I don't know anything about it. That's part of what makes it fun is watching somebody figure it out, experience it. So, you know, relax. We'll get through this together. I promise. Calm down. Check game FAQs. Yeah, just watch and enjoy. What if I, um, hang on. I might try calling the Colonel, uh, in the fight. I might try calling him. We'll see. Maybe they'll, maybe they'll tell me something or like somebody else. In-game backseating? Shut the fuck up. Huh? Let's see, what do you got to say? Uh, I like how they're going to give you like a full back. back. I'm, I'm in the middle of a boss fight. <laughs> uh, he knows every move you're going to make. What should I do? I've got no chance of beating him. There must be some way. Don't let him manipulate you. Not everything you see with your two eyes is real. 
Destroying his spirit is more important than destroying his body. Don't let him read you. Be a blank slate, okay? Clear your mind. The fuck does that mean? I've got it. Use the controller port. Plug your controller into controller port 2. If you do that, he won't be able to read you your mind. You want me to use the fucking keyboard? How? What? I don't even know how to move with the keyboard. You're kidding me? Use the keyboard? How do you even shoot? This is bullshit. What do you mean use the keyboard? How do I even move with the keyboard? Bro, you're kidding me, right? You're kidding. You're actually kidding me. Get the hell out of here. Oh my God. Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding. I don't know how to use the fucking keyboard in this game. It took me, it was, dude, it took me forever just to, just, I'm so, hang on, hang on here. I got to show you this because I've got to, this is awful. Oh, this is so infuriating. Oh my God. It's like, I don't even know what it's doing. Can I move? Can I shoot? Let's crouch. What was shoot? Uh, what was it? Two? Okay, so two swaps your items, I guess. It's like an auto swap. What's happening? So in this fight, you have to swap. You can't... How, wait, so I can't even shoot her, so it also makes me take out my weapon? So like, how do I... Can I how do I put away my weapon? What's... is... Unarmed. Put away your weapon, you fuck! How do I even put away the weapon? God, this is so frustrating! Oh my god! It's so infuriating! God, yes! My head. So fucking annoying! Come on, Mr. Foxhound, a commander is waiting. I'm gonna try to do this with the key. I'm. I just walked in with the keyboard. We're gonna try this. Okay, what is punch? What is punch? What is punch? I don't remember what punch is. What is punch? Snake. Yes. What is select? I don't have select. This is so stupid. It's like the dumbest thing, man. God, what even was it? Space? Space is punch. God damn it, man. How do I get up? <laughs> get up. Oh. It's getting to me. My so head. Goddamn infuriating. Oh, it hurts. So infuriating. Come on, Mr. Fox. I really, really hope that when the fight actually starts with the boss, I really hope they let me use the. If they don't let me use the controller, I'm gonna be pretty fucking bummed. I'm pretty fucking bummed. I really, really hope they do. It's a cool fight on play. I, I understand this. This was like at the time it's mind blowing because of good old games, because of PC, because of the port, because of the only way I have available to me to play it. It is infuriating. It's not the game's fault. It's 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 the fact that there is just no good way to do this. Uh, I really hope I can swap. Useless 
woman. Optic camouflage, huh? I hope that's not your only. Okay, so I'm back on controller. I don't think it's working, guys. Literally, what is shoot? What is shoot? I don't even remember what I said. What is shoot? Why must, why is the keyboard controller too? Why, why couldn't it be the opposite? Why couldn't it be the opposite, man? Literally, why couldn't it be the opposite? Why couldn't it be the opposite, man? Come on. It's so unfair, man. Why, why does it have to be like this? It didn't have to be this way. I don't want to play Metal Gear Solid on a fucking keyboard. I don't. There's no way. Why, dude? Just like, just like Kojima intended on a fucking keyboard on good old games, man. So stupid. So fucking unfair, man. Uh, I'm out of heals too. I don't know. I honestly don't think I'm going to be able to beat this. I, I don't I don't know how I'm going to beat this. I honestly don't know. I honestly don't know how I'm going to beat this, actually. I don't know how I'm going to beat this at all. What if you plug in a second controller? I don't think that works, dude. Well, I mean, I guess I'm just going to have to figure this out and and tough it out somehow I, I don't know how i'm gonna do it maybe maybe if i i would say like maybe if i could do grenades or something like maybe that would do more damage to him i guess but i don't know man it seems fucking it's it's so like playing on the key on the controller how does smoke look play it i'm i assume he's got it on playstation 3 or something i think he plays on console come on mr foxhound I yeah he's got a ps3 Oh, God. This is really frustrating. It's not expensive. The problem is capturing it because capturing classic PlayStation is a fucking like awful nightmare. <laughs> I'm not I'm not doing that. I just I just sooner quit the game than I me mean, invest in a gigantic PlayStation setup for fucking no reason. It's not worth it. Emulate it. I'm not even sure how 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 would I even do it on emulator? I don't even know. <laughs> Is an emulator the same problem? Um, I don't remember what fire is. What was fire again? Uh, it's control. I mean, I thought maybe grenades would be good, but it turns out I'm just blowing myself up. Does that even hit him? I guess, I guess grenades don't hit him. I guess grenades don't hit him. Oh, okay. I already called the colonel. The commander is waiting. Already called him. There's another way. Fuck you. I'm not looking for help. Fuck off. Eat shit. Clear enough for you? Eat shit. Fuck off.
Yeah, I mean, I, I guess I, I just have to use control. I have to use keyboard, I guess. Okay. I hate this shit because he just spawns it right on you. Controlling this game with a controller is like the worst. This is like the worst gaming experience I think I've ever had in my life. I literally think, I think this probably is like the worst gaming experience I've ever had. It's so awful to control, dude. I'm playing on my fucking keyboard. Oh, is it over? Hang on. Oh, come on. What? Am I still fighting you? Can I sh just fight you normal now? I guess I can't. I can't move! Oh god, I was pressing E and not W. Fucking die. Bro, no, I don't want to do this anymore. Please, God, no. I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to play with a fucking keyboard anymore, man. Oh, please, no! No! Give me a break! <laughs> Fucking hell, dude! Bro, doing this boss Colonel, fight with a fucking keyboard okay. was like Thanks. the worst. That was actually, I think I that might be one, one of the worst now gaming experience I have ever no, had in my life. Wear off, right, Naomi? Yes. <sighs> But why did you go so far out of your way to save her? For Campbell's sake, or maybe it's because you like her? I don't want to see any woman die right in front of me. Oh, really? 
Since when did anybody's death bother you oh. so much? Naomi, it's true that Snake has killed a lot of people. That's awful. That doesn't mean he doesn't have a heart. It's okay, Try Colonel. It with the power glove. She's right. So, and you used the other computer. I, I wasn't able to read the future. A strong man doesn't need to read the future. He makes God his game. own. Uh. <laughs> Perhaps so. But I will read your future. <laughs> to get to Metal Gear's underground maintenance base. <sighs> you have to go through that hidden door. There's a hidden door behind the bookcase. The Overland Road. It's blocked by frozen glaciers. Go past the communication towers. And use the tower's walkway. Why are you telling me this? I can read people's minds. In my lifetime, I have read the past, presents, and futures of thousands upon thousands of men and women. Give this oh, people gross. air. And each mind that I peered into was stuffed with the same single object of obsession. That selfish and atavistic desire to pass on one seed. It was enough to make me sick. Every living thing on this planet exists to mindlessly pass on their DNA. We're designed that way. And that's why there is war. But you... You are different. You're the same as us. We have no past, no future. We live in the moment. That's our only purpose. Humans weren't designed to bring each other happiness. From the moment we're thrown into this world. We're fated to bring each other nothing but pain and misery. The first person whose mind I dove into was my father's. I saw nothing but disgust and hatred for me in his heart. My mother died in childbirth. <laughs> And he despised me for it. I thought my father was going to kill me. Are you doing okay? I hope the game doesn't make me play with my, my with my future. keyboard anymore. <laughs> really, really. I hope. I'll be okay well. if it doesn't make me do that shit again. When I came to, the village was engulfed in flames. Are you saying that you burned your village down to bury your past? I see that you have suffered the same trauma. <laughs> this one's gonna ask for pedals on the steering we wheel. The same. <laughs> you and I. Uh, like this game on a controller well, is clunky and really awkward. Like on a keyboard, I want to fucking break never everything. <laughs> with the boss's revolution. On a keyboard, I want to smash every single thing in this room. <laughs> I just wanted an excuse to kill as many people as I could. You monster. Let him talk. He doesn't have much time left. Let him cook. I've seen through evil. You, Snake. You're just like the boss. No, you're worse. Compared to you, I'm not so bad. I read her mind as well. Merrill's? I saw you there. You have a large place in your heart. A large place? Yes, a large place. But I do not know if your futures lie together. Didn't we just meet? I have a last <laughs> request. What is it? My mask. 
put it back on. Okay. Like this. Other people's thoughts force their way into my mind. Before I die, I want to be by myself. I want to be left alone in my own world. <laughs> for you. If you want to find your future, go through that door. This is the first time I've ever used my power to help someone. It's strange. It feels kind of Did you miss the psycho fight? You did. It was awful. <laughs> it was awful. Let's go, Meryl. I'm sorry. Meryl? How could I let Mantis control my mind like that? If you're gonna doubt yourself, I'll leave you here. You're right. Never doubt yourself. Just let it make you stronger. Learn something from it. Well, you're right. it's... It's a wildly different experience when you can use a controller and be like, oh, I can just switch to another controller. I can't Snake, do that on Steam or on, on good old games. But I have to use to a say. keyboard. I don't have I that option. Wondering. What? What's the problem now? Oh, no, nothing. I even tried going so, into the fight Snake, with a keyboard. What's your name? Your real name? A name means nothing on the battlefield. How old are you? Old enough to know what death looks like. Any family? No, but I was raised by many people. Is there anyone you like? I've never been interested in anyone else's life. So you are all alone. Just like Mantis said. Other people just complicate my life. I don't like to get involved. You're a sad, lonely man. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> oh, please, for the love of God, save. You look like Meryl's okay. You truly are a king, yo. Was about to keep offering to land you my own PS3 so you wouldn't have to suffer. I wouldn't have let a holy the suffer like that. Cheers. And feel so nice for some more of you. Uh, TT language, $10. TLDR, who asked, uh, shut the fuck up. It gave me $10, bitch. It's more than you ever given me. Shut your fucking pie hole. <laughs> shut the fuck up, bitch. I don't see you giving me $10. Uh, I say. You called Snake? Let me really make sure I say. You said that you wanted to become a pilot. Did you take an aptitude test? Well, I've got bad eyes. You probably didn't know it, but I'm wearing contact lenses. So you failed your aptitude test, huh? Yeah, it's ridiculous. We're not flying around in biplanes anymore, you know? That's right. Today's pilots fly jets that go several times the speed of sound. Exactly. At those speeds, the naked eye isn't that useful. You need sophisticated electronics to see what's really going on. So is that why you developed your radar system? Yeah, I wanted to develop a radar system that would help soldiers make better, more informed decisions. So your radar shows what's really going on, huh? Depends on how you interpret it. Like beauty, truth is in the eye of the beholder. You can say that again. Lived our game. Died a lot. Was extremely frustrated. Yeah, I can imagine that this was a way cooler experience if you played the game when it first came out <laughs> and not on steam <laughs> or on good old games you must fight psycho mantis in minecraft it's probably a much much better experience uh i guess our rations the only way to heal yourself in the game huh the gamecube version was Give pretty good here. Oh, uh level five there we go